Welcome back, everyone. Thank you, darling. It's interesting it's how the Warriors. truth can sometimes seem uh, might malleable, depending upon your point of view. Last time we lost our like how those dime novels make you out to be something you're not. Jack, don't be starting trouble. No, he's right. They do tend to exaggerate. Did they exaggerate your part in taking down the Daltons? Well, I was there in the flesh, boy, so I saw what happened firsthand. The Dalton brothers. Those Daltons were lawmen once, before they all went bad, robbing banks and trains clear across the territory. Until Coffeeville, of course. I was one of the citizens who took up arms that day. Fighting on the side of right. I did my best, sir. We all did. Guess we're getting some Daltons. All right. It was as long as no morning, one is shooting at us. One of my friends was a local gunsmith, and he handed out firearms to anybody who'd take one. You see, the Dalton's got it in their heads to rob two banks at the same time. Two banks on the same damn street. A shooter or a ranger? You can't stand against the door. Well, where did that other one go? Oh, well. The story was Bob Dalton's girl was always writing him about how he had no ambition. Sorry. Oh, you're sorry, nobody sorry. next to Jesse James, she'd say. Finally, the bastard took his brothers to Coffeville just to shut her up. Right. It's always the woman's fault. Alright. I was trying well, to look at this earlier. Recognized the Dalton's right oh, off. I didn't know they would still narrate. Um, I actually took a look at these two things, and this one is a lot of uh, shotgun and damage resistance and dynamite stuff. This is pretty cool, you can dual wield sawed off shotguns. But I have decided to go for the long range because um, it has a lot of uh, ammo stuff, um, increased aim times, or not increased, decreased aim times. And this thing looks pretty cool. You can throw a stick of dynamite and then you shoot it and it splits into three dynamite. So that's pretty cool. So I'm gonna start with the with the um what is this is the ranger tree. Before they could get away, half the town took up arms to defend their property. Their Let's first go mistake Dolphins. was pulling a job in their own damn hometown. The boys grew up in Coffeeville, so everybody knew it. Bank teller tricked them, telling them the time lock on the safe wouldn't open till 9:30. Well, that gave the locals enough time to prepare an ambush for those sons of bitches. All right. Right in your head. Look at that hat. The brothers paid dearly for their stupidity, but everybody knows they had it coming. There's more to it than that. I read all about that day, so I know for a fact that it went down very differently. <laughs> First of all, it was high noon. A posse of U.S. Deputy Marshals were on the rooftop across the street. I'm not a U.S. Marshal. What am I doing up here? Lawmen have been tracking the dogs for months. So I can't really see. Oh, they're all on the roof. Among them is a bounty hunter feared by many lawbreakers. Ow! Where is this guy? There he is. This man had no intention of letting the Dalton slip away. They met an adversary that day who had no fear and offered them no quarter. The marshals tried to get the Daltons to surrender. They'll give up eventually. We just gotta wait to set the bitches out. This bounty hunter knew that the brothers were far too proud to ever lay down their guns. <laughs> Doesn't look like they're laying down their guns. Yeah, that in there alone seems about right. Oh, there's a letter. One of the marshals shouted, Where are you going? Are you crazy? Hey, where do you think you're going, dumbass? That rifle's mine. We paid him no <laughs> mind. <laughs> that rifle's mine. He saw a way to get around to the back of the bank.
I am really, really enjoying Many this game. figured out how to hit the Daltons from a direction they weren't expecting. From the behinds. That's not dirty. I don't know what you're talking about. From above. Oh, from above. Fortunately, a water tower was right there. A moment later, he was climbing up a steep ladder, laughing at danger as he did. Am I gonna laugh? No. Those brave men like him who risked their lives to tame this wild country. Oh, that looks dangerous. Oh. That does not, those do not look like jumps that you can make. Oh man, so scary. What's up, guys? I'm on a roof. Um. Now what? Am I, oh, oh, here we go. I didn't see this. Oh, poor guy. We've got company. Heroic men like him did what other men couldn't or wouldn't to make this country free. Dynamite. I wonder if I can dynamite after I break Jim down Boone, the door. Davy Crockett. Let's try it out. Is that Silas Greaves? Son of a bitch! Oh, I only had. One the dynamite. Mm, oh well. I commend your survivability from the dynamites. Ah. Damn you, tree. Come out, you yellow bastard. That's racist. That guy called me a yellow bastard. All right, so what, what, what? What, where, all right, what is that? That's a quick shooter. Ah, okay, these things reload faster. Whoa. They also don't seem to do enough damage. I'm gonna stick with these ones. They reload slower, but they seem to do a bit more damage. Oh, oh, oh. Dodge. Alright. Man, I am messing up all kinds on those things. Sorry about that. That Silas Greaves! What the hell? Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, there we go. Last guy. He came away victorious, taking down those thieving dogs. Is that it? Everyone's dead. Huh. Whoa. Alright. His name? Silas Greaves. And when the dust finally settled, he was the last man standing. Sorry, kid, but that just wasn't the way it happened. Let's do this for a third time. It was early evening, not high noon. <laughs> oh, this is so funny. Oh my. I was late to the party and Coffeeville was already up in arms. The Daltons blew up a safe and were all set to hightail it out of there. Those pathetic deputies surrounding the bank were dropping like flies. Peter the lover than the loser. Nice. I had been tracking those jokers for months, waiting for them oh, to oh, do oh, something. I can't reckless. move while they're shooting at me. Finally, they did. Those stupid <gasps> bastards decided to rob two banks at the same time in the same town where everybody knew them. But they still had friends and coffee. There we go. That was that was a bit awkward there. No. All right, so let's see if I can just shoot through that. There we go. Gotcha. All right, so this is where they came out of. It doesn't seem like they would go back in. Where am I? Where am I going? All-knowing objective marker. Lead me.
Oh, hey guys. I'll just follow you. Hey, we got a deal. Those friends came after me like a pack of wild dogs. Tooth and nail. They were coming at me from all directions. I caught sight of the Daltons running with the money and didn't want to lose them. The problem was, they knew the town better than I did. And to top it off, I found myself in the middle of another shootout on tires. Right. Did the Daltons pull up in somebody's house? No, it was the uh, Smiths, I believe. They were cousins of the Daltons. And they were shooting at the Browns, who were shooting at the Daltons. Which wasn't any surprise, because those two families have been feuding forever. Alright, let's get out of here. Alley, alley, alley. Since the Joneses are related to the Browns, they shot on the Smiths. Pissing off the Heimhoffers, whose daughter recently married. I didn't see him at all. Well, bullets were flying every which way as all the old feuds in Kansas caught fire all at once. There was a hell of a lot of pissed off people in Coffeeville that day. But that's just the way life is sometimes. Shit happens. Indeed. All right, I see you. Let's go upstairs. Is there anyone up here? Hello? Nope, no one up here. All right. Let's go back down. Um, I'm not entirely. Oh, okay. The Dalton boys knew I would never give up. Those Daltons weren't the sharpest knives in the drawer, but they always stood together. They set a trap to slow me down and allow at least two of them to escape. Ah, oh, okay. All right. How do I dodge that? I have to jump underneath it or something? Jump underneath it? Um, can I, can I go? Oh. <laughs> I really don't understand what I'm supposed to be doing here. I can't, I can't get to the left or to the right. Oh, I missed that one. Okay, can I... Well, this is definitely slowing me down. I'm, I guess I'm just, okay, just supposed to hide and stuff. Alright, well, now I can't get over this damn log. Um. Now what? I can't jump up there. All-knowing objective marker, lead me to my destination. Mm. It was him. Oh, that's the not, that's And he good. decided to stand his ground and face me down. I ain't afraid of you, Silas Reeves. This is where it ends for you. Oh my! He was determined to protect his brothers. I understood how he felt. Taking me on all by his lonesome wasn't exactly a recipe for a long life. Ow! Run away or just fall off the cliff and die really quick. That works too, I guess. I don't I don't really understand how it's Ow! I did it again. Alright, that was let's just ignore that that happened. Let's try and run to the left. Let's try and run over here. Alright, let's do- Oh, then he comes up there! How am I supposed to get away from this guy? Is that gonna do anything? That's okay. Don't don't kill me, mister. I'm gonna tear you apart! Ow! Oh my gosh! What is the right way to do this? I feel it feels like I'm doing this all wrong. But Emma Dalton survived the robbery in Coffeeville. He's the only Dalton who did. They say he was shot 23 times. Well, yeah, Dwight, who do you think times. put all those damn holes in him? But I have to admit, that boy had grit. Alrighty then. Thanks for watching, everyone.
until next time, when we shoot more people, hopefully a bit easier on us. Take care. Thanks for watching.